All right, let's do this. So I put something together here in this house. I didn't think I was ever going to be able to make something like this happen so soon. I mean, I've only known the guys for a short amount of time, but I'm already up, you know, like up, up on this one quick payday, the divine way. <laughs> Welcome to 9855 St. Elmo. Dietrich came across this opportunity. There was this house here for $350,000. So we sat down in Subway and on the back of a Subway napkin negotiated a $20,000 payday for Dietrich. That $20,000 helped him get to the finish line, ultimately moving his floating home from Redwood City all the way to Sausalito, where he's getting ready to put that on the market now and sell for close to 1.4 million. There was a lot of moving parts in that deal. Yeah. There was the negotiating with Dietrich. There was even some back-end money that's gonna be there. There was negotiating with the owner. And there was negotiating with the tenant's family. Yes. Everybody had a moving part in this yeah. as far as relocating furniture because it was a lot of cleaning out to do and keeping things that the previous tenant needed. How do we even secure the financing on this deal in such a quick time? What, what did you do? What did we do? We just ran comps. We made sure that there was enough value in for the price that we were going to buy it for and then contacted our money guy. Yeah. Um, tied up one of our other assets. Uh, if you want to move fast, if you want, you have to put out some of your other assets out there to get that money wired in quick. <laughs> expense that I saw come across my desk was a $9,500 roof. You got it. Tell me about this roof. You know, you want to make sure you get that curb appeal. And what we had before was damaged roof rafters and they were creating all these soft spots in the roof. So we called up our roofer for the last 15 years. His name's Martin. He got up there and put a new roof on in a week. That was step one. Next check. What was the next check? Driveway. It yeah. was $8,000 for the new driveway. And we did make it about four feet wider to fit two cars comfortably. We put a nice curve in it to tie into the edge of the house there. And then we had our guy Daniel stamp these uh, stone look into the driveway before it cured. And while we're talking about concrete, Greg, the city of Oakland has an ordinance, right? Yeah, that was the sidewalk ordinance. What does that mean? That means if there is, I think it's the one fourth inch lip anywhere on the sidewalk, your sidewalk needs to be replaced to prevent a tripping hazard. Yes, and our guy that did our driveway for 8,000 also did about, what does that look about? Maybe right. 10 or 12 feet. It was waving. It was wet, yeah, it was yeah. moving. So we wrapped that up and then he also used, while we had the bobcat out, we leveled off the landscaping in the front and the backyard to be ready for grass. Mm -hmm. So for all in $9,000, he really took care of prepping the landscaping, yeah. our driveway, the sidewalk ordinance issue, and getting the backyard level and ready. I think for the backyard, we're just gonna keep it dirt yeah. um, and just uh, let whoever buys this home do what they will with the backyard. Next major expense. Yes. Which we needed for our security that we were talking about oh. was that gate. Crucial. Crucial, yes. How much did that run us? I think we came in around six, six yeah. Six but, but what we paid a, a get your ass out here and put it up fee. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. With the pandemic, there was a delay because our welder comes and does this on site, but the rolling gate and to get it powder coated and painted. He had a connection that he had to pay a rush for. So I think we ended up spending an extra $900. Yeah. He wanted $1,200, we negotiated down to $900 okay. um, to get that gate up. But since we've got the gate up and Top Dog Security, our cousin Lenny, mm -hmm. we've had no more issues with anybody uh, trespassing on the property. So it was worth every penny. What did you see when we first got here and we were, you know, bright eyed, bushy tailed? Day one, we still had hair. We still had hair that back then. Well, y'all well, was college educated and willing to learn and it took you to being multi-millionaires mm -hmm. so that's a great thing you know i'm proud of both y'all appreciate it you yeah. know because i know i had a hand in it yes and that's all right you sure did <laughs> when we got this property we were thinking 
it would sell somewhere around five hundred thousand dollars. But what is happening in this market right now? What do so you see? this is the power of team. When you, when you got this deal going, you called me and said, "Hey, how much is it worth?" I looked it up. Five hundred thousand dollars. Since then, the comps are raised up to about five fifty, five seventy five on a bad day. Who do we call when it's time to sell a home? Call Jerry. Hashtag call Jerry. Special thanks to Jerry. He's already run comps for us too and solidified what you did on your research and told us that we're gonna have a pretty good payday on this one. I think so. Check us out on YouTube. Grab one of these t-shirts. Some of them are fitted depending on how much you work out. Get one of these things. So what do you think, Greg? Should we start doing some one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions with these uh, new investors out there? Uh, Maybe take them to some projects, let them see what we do? Yeah, I mean, that's a great avenue. That's a great avenue to learn. Uh, that's a great avenue to get in this business if you're interested. Mm -hmm. um, and that's a great, another avenue to create wealth for yourself. Yeah, so drop a comment. You want Greg to be your instructor or you want me to be your instructor? We'll give you some <laughs> tours. Pick which one you want to deal with. We'll work with you take you to some projects, let you meet architects, let you meet engineers, contractors of every trade, and so that you can get top dollar. Yeah, and start with one, and two, and then three, four, and more. That's it, All right. let's go make some money. All right. Bro. All right, cut and print, beautiful guys. Dynamite, that is.